Come with me and you will see a little piece of history right before our eyes, you and me. Dig in here and search in there, find the treasures everywhere. We'll spend the day like gypsies being free. Come with me on this beautiful day. Find pieces of the past in this journey of today. Hey friends, Gypsy here with Zero Discrimination. Today I'm out at my favorite spot down by the river and um, I've got the Garrett AT Pro Sport Package with the smaller 5x8 coil. Um, let me show you what I'm going to be hunting in today. Come around here, I'm going to go ahead and power it on. Of course I got headphones on right now. I've got it in zero, zero discrimination mode and I've got it in pro mode. Now you can always switch that if you need to. This is standard. Standard zero, but we want to go back to pro and then I'm going to go on down back to zero. And I've got it at zero iron discrimination. Now I can turn my iron audio. I don't know how well you can see that uh, with the shadow there. Um, but I can turn my iron audio on if I want or I can leave it off. Hopefully I'll be able to pick in between a lot of, there's a lot of trash out here, and uh, pick in between some of that iron and see what I can find. So I'll see you on the first decent target. All right, so I just got my first target. It was uh, popping up to about a 75. I just pulled it out. At first I thought it might be part of a shoe buckle frame. Sorry for the wind folks, a little windy today. But I'm thinking by seeing the way this is right here that it might be the top part of an old little change purse. Not 100% sure on that. All right, let's see what else we can find. A lot of roots down here. Getting a root there. Just popping up 75. There's a big root right there I'm hitting. Uh, we can get around this root without busting it. Said it was about four inches down. Uh, but that may be it. <laughs> We've got um, part to an old water hose, I think. Saw brass. All right, let's see what else we can find. Got an old speaker, I think. Well, I didn't know what I had. <laughs> anyway, all right, we'll see what else we can find. It's a salt shaker, aluminum lid, I think. All right, on to the next. So I just dug this, I'm not sure what it is. It's got these little holes on both sides. There is some writing here, so maybe when I get it home and get it cleaned up, I can figure out what that says. So, uh, interesting, let's see what else we can find. Hi there friends, Gypsy here. Um, I'm uh, back out today uh, with the Garrett AT Pro, a sport special package, and um, I'm going to be kind of detecting in the same area as you saw earlier in the video. And um, it's a lot colder today, not, not as sunny as it was, but um, 
going to see what I can find and then I may be exploring a little farther down um, in a new area. So here we go. Let's go find some treasure. All right, first find of the day was a bottle cap. This is a second find. And uh, this had this giant rock in this hole. Look what I popped out of the bottom. I was barely picking it up. Got a little gear, maybe to a little clock or pocket watch. So uh, neat find. Let's see what else we can find. All right, so I just got that gear. And then just to pop this, was under this rock, I moved the rock away and dug down. And I don't know what it is. Uh, oh! Cool! It's got like a claw, a leg. I don't know if that would have been to a small piece of furniture. That is cool! I wonder if it held something here. I've seen those in antique stores where it holds like a little crystal ball there or something. Still got a little bit of gold plating on it. That is neat. I love it. Cool. Awesome. When I get it home, I'll get it cleaned up and see if I can find any markings or anything. Feels like it may be brass. Awesome. All right, I'll see you on the next. All right, I'm a little out of breath. I've been trying to dig around this rock. I'm getting like a solid 86 signal on the AT Pro right here in the center under this rock. But this rock seems to be pretty big and I'm trying to get my shovel under it. I can't, it just, the rock seems to be getting bigger and bigger. So I'm gonna keep trying. Uh, anyway, I'll let you know if it's anything good, if I can get it out. Okay, uh, five minutes later, I got the rock out. It's pretty heavy. And I'm now, it's not like a solid 86, it's hitting like a 76 here. Uh, some glass. Uh, let me see. A lot of more rock in here. Oh, darn it. It's a mason jar lid. Oh. Oh. Too bad it's not attached to the jar full of silver coins. All right, that was hard work for a mason jar lid. I'll see you on the next. Three Merry Widows lid. Uh, this would be the top. Those of you that haven't found one of these yet, uh, go ahead and look it up if you don't know what it is. <laughs> All right. Cool find. Let's see what else we can find. Hey, folks. So I was getting like a penny dime reading right here, and I just popped it up. It's still stuck in the roots. It looks like a ring. Probably going to be a junk ring just by the looks of it, but let me uh, see if I can get this glove off. Sorry, just a second here. Ha, sorry about this. Well, we'll just do it this way. Uh, all right, looks like a little star with some bling maybe definitely a kid size pop that all right cool huh. there we have it got some aurora borealis looking bling in there uh, looks like it's starting to corrode there all right, got a ring, just got a penny, my first coin from the for the day, but uh, cool find. 
Just got my friend. You can see him over there in the parking lot. Just popped out of his car. Randy, he's going to come detect with me. <laughs> he's getting suited up. Uh, he was got his uh, Garrett 18 Max, and I think he was going to bring his Deus XP. Um, so, uh, XP Deus, sorry. And uh, we'll see what else we can find. See you on the next. All right, first dig of the day, my buddy um, Randy just got this. First three steps into the woods. Three steps into the woods, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's got his XP, is it the XP Deus? Mm -hmm. Sweet. And uh, look what he just gave me. <laughs> this thing is awesome. He made it out of one of his boots. Mm -hmm. So cool. Thank you so much. Comes from the heart. <laughs> That's what There's counts, a boot right? that comes from the heart. A boot that comes from the heart. He also gave me one of these. This is what he's using as his digger. I've already got it belted on. I've been using it right here. Love it. Does a nice clean little plug in this grass. All right, we're going to hit this hard, huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right. We're going to try. We're going to try. We will see you on the next, folks. We got Randy over there. He's digging all kinds of good goodies <laughs> with his XP. I just tugged this brass nozzle here. Huge thing. All right, cool find. Looks like it's been here a while. All right, let's see what else we can find, Randy. What'd you find over there? Something interesting? It looks like a molar. <laughs> <laughs> really? I gotta go check this out. Let's check this out. It looks like somebody's molar or something. <laughs> I don't know, man. Could be. You never know. No. Interesting. It's a piece of it's a piece of metal, I think. All scrunched up. It looks like the cap of something, maybe an old makeup. Or yeah. Something. When I first pulled it up, I said, "Oh my God, somebody <laughs> lost their molar." It does look like <laughs> the shape of it. All right. We'll see y'all on the next. Okay. All right, friends, there's Randy. He's about to dig a, a gold ring. Let's hope. Something good. <laughs> I just dug to China, just about. And I dug way down, and I just popped this lid, and Randy and I were taking a look at it. Let me see if I can zoom in here a little better. Um, Iodex, iodine. <laughs> <laughs> if I can read all this and rub until color disappears New York is that Montreal then on the bottom down at the bottom here it says London and then uh, Tinley and Jan some something Janston Jan, something sample. I'll look that up. That's pretty cool. All right. I think he just found his gold ring. Yeah, sure. It, sure <laughs> it's, it's a little rusty right now. I, I just need to polish it up. <laughs> right. We have found a lot of bottle caps out here. All right. We'll see y'all in the next. All right, Randy and I are wrapping it up for the day. We and, be done. Uh, here's all the goodies he found. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing. That's kind of cool. I wonder what that went to. He's got all kinds of doodads here. This is my favorite thing right here. He's got a little owl. Can you see him? He's cute. You can see part of his little feathers there on the back. And then he got this little rivet thing. It's shiny, it's got a pretty little design on it. And then he got a penny. <laughs> Woohoo, you're rich. rich. I can't tell exactly what that is. Maybe you can. I think it says 2002. Let me zoom in there. 2002D. And then uh, these are from a hunt. Another day, you already put them away. Mm. Get them out. 
he's got all these little tree tree markers that he's found. A couple keys. And a couple keys, three keys. Cool. All right, we're rich now, aren't we? <laughs> I don't know if I was supposed to take these off the trees or not, but I found a bunch of them. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Fun, right, Randy? Probably save the tree marker or something. <laughs> I, I, I just found them. I had to take them, you know. <laughs> you had to. Kind of neat. Well, I'm not going to dig in here right now, pull everything out. I was here longer than Randy, so um, I'll pull it all out when I get home. Uh, this nice little handy dandy thing that he gave me. Uh, I've got full of all kinds of trash in there that I dug. And uh, what is that? Oh, that's neat. Not sure what that is. And he's got a battery, and there's his, your tooth. <laughs> my tooth. All right, it was fun. I had fun. So How about you, Randy? Yep, I had a blast. <laughs> okay. Every day, every day metal detecting is, is a fun day. It is a fun day, even when you're digging trash. We're even cleaning up the environment. Even when you go home empty. <laughs> <handed>. <laughs> we had fun. All right, folks. I'll see y'all at the wrap-up. Bye for now. Hey friends, you saw Randy's uh, wrap up. I'll we'll go ahead and do a quick wrap up here. These are my coins that I found. Uh, one quarter, a bunch of pennies, all modern, and two dimes. Button. Um, so we got this, and I'm still not sure what it is, and it's made at some manufacturing company in Indiana. There's my kitten, Willow. She's interested in my trash over there that I found at this one and then um, let's see what else this huge piece of lead then uh, for my favorite find I got this iodex salve stuff I'll put a non dug photo of it up for you. Um, then I got the Merry Widows lid tin. Three Merry Widows. And then one of my favorite finds was this right here. It's like an eagle claw of some sort. I'm not sure. Um, stands up like this. And there's Willow climbing on the table. Uh, let's see. Got another lid, copper piece. This piece um, is the uh, little thing off a tree that uh, Randy found. He gave that one to me. Salt shaker lid. And then the thing that I dug way under that rock. Yes, I did check under that rock again. Make sure there was, I mean, in that hole. Make sure there was nothing else in there. The only other thing I found was non-metal. This little pretty piece of... Uh, pottery and then um, got a fuse another piece of metal with a number on the bottom did get <clears throat> this big brass nozzle here and then my bling ring uh, junk ring with the uh, Aurora Borealis like stones in it there's a few missing there I think too anyway still fun fine ring number one for 2019 uh, Starting off the new year with my ring count. And this little owl um, here, this is um, the little owl that uh, Randy found. He gave it to me. And uh, thanks again, Randy, for all the goodies you gave me. Um, the uh, leather uh, boot pouch that you made. I love it, love it, love it. And the digger, I'll be using both of those in many upcoming hunts. Thanks again all for watching, and uh, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe, and just dig it.